Hey YouTubers, thanks for stopping by and taking a peek. Uh, we've been working on the Porsche Panamera Project Blackout. As you can see, we're doing the uh, door handles, did the uh, mirrors, and we did the uh, chrome door trim delete. Real quick, I just want to do a special shout out to the guys over on Facebook, uh, Porsche Panamera Tips and Tricks. If you guys want to see more mods and cool tricks uh, to deck out your Porsche Panamera, Make sure you go and uh, follow and like these guys over there. It's a good group. Going to do a lot of video tutorials, a lot of a lot of cool stuff coming up. So, special shout out! All right, guys, we're going to dip into this and uh, show you how I did all this. All right, friends, we are committed to this project now. I've got all the uh, pre-taped uh, plastic wrapped around. You see, we got a couple. Uh, couple areas to start working on. This is where the uh, little detailed work comes in. So, uh, so far, all together, this is uh, taking me 10 minutes. So, all the prep work is easy. It doesn't take long. It looks intimidating, but it really isn't. So once you get the, once you get that done, you can see I'm, I've already started my detail work here. You just cut, uh, you know, little two, three inch pieces and just start start slapping them in there and then get you get you a little tool like this and just uh, lightly press it in no big deal and then once you get to little areas like this this is where you can use it to just kind of push it in there So uh, I decided to go ahead and even this up and just go uh, flush with the trim there instead of taking the chance of peeling it. The only reason when I was laying it back here I noticed there was a little bit in between there like something you know no, there wasn't really much of a gap so I just uh, this is the safe way to do it. Uh, the trick to this is once you lay your last coat you just go ahead and grab the tape and peel it while it's still wet. Which I'll show you more about that. Okay, it's time for the magic to begin. Alright guys, so we're uh, moving along here on the window seal and mirror project. Sorry if I sound like Darth Vader, I got my breathing protection on. Still nice and wet. I just went ahead and threw a nice thick coat down. Look at that. Nice and glossy. Alright guys, we got a got a whole can over here on this side. I did spray the bottom of this, but I am going to pull that uh, black layer off. So yeah. Everything looks good there. All right, guys, uh, I've got everything all done up over here. I uh, started to uh, go ahead and pull this off. 
Now, I would love to go ahead and do all this with you guys on here, but uh, it's really hard to do one-handed and be gentle about it. I'm just going to show you just a tiny bit here. And then, uh, and then I'm just going to cut the camera off and finish taking it off. And as you, as you can see, it's, it's coming off really nice. Alright guys, uh, we got the majority of the tape pulled here. I just wanted to show you guys a quick... Uh, sometimes you, you get a little bit of overspray, which is fine. Just uh, remember that this is uh, it's rubber, so all you got to do is just get in here with a little cloth and just rub it, and it comes right off. It's this stuff is really really cool. So you don't have to worry about getting it on the paint; it just it comes off. It's nothing to worry about. And if you ever run into some stubborn areas, all you got to do is just take a little WD-40, put it on the end of your. Uh, your towel here and that WD-40 eats right through this stuff. Alright, so we got uh, everything pulled off here. And guys, this turned out beautiful. I, uh, I left this here. I've decided that uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, tape all this off real quick. And uh, I'm just going to plasti dip this bottom half and see if it'll rectify the ugliness here before I go tearing it off if it doesn't then uh, it is what it is I'll just tear it all off and make it white again all right guys we are down to the final steps I have pulled all the tape off except for left this little bit in here Just to give you guys something to see here. So at this point, uh, I just grab a rag with a little bit of goo gone on it. I'll run around and, you know, hit uh, all the areas that the adhesive on the back of the tape stuck to. Overall, it, uh, it turned out beautiful. I went ahead and did the uh, bottoms of the mirrors and I think it uh, saved them they definitely definitely look a lot better now I'm gonna pull it out here in the what's left of the Sun so we can get a better look at it it out uh, really nice got our door trim done here if you guys aren't following me on Instagram go uh, hit up some tower dog 81 This is what it's all about guys total cost for this uh, window trim delete and the mirrors cost me uh, I did one can on each side so I'd say probably about 15 bucks total with the the tape off material and it just uh, man this looks really good the wheels are matching door handles a lot of guys didn't like that I did the uh, fuel cap, so. I went ahead and just uh, took it off. But, uh, yeah, that's it, guys. I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. 
you guys uh, wouldn't mind supporting my channel, please hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up on the video, and uh, I'll keep more content coming your way.